tension. You know, you have some distance mm -hmm. here. Um, now, I'm going to let this go, and I'm going to show you the over twist. You see how it twists back on itself? That, that's a good thing. That's good. Yes, you want to do a high twist or an over twist. Now I'm going to switch hands, so I don't want my blue one to get away from me. If it does, it happens, and then you'll so if you have little pieces retwist sticking it. Out, do you cut that's them fine, off? no, because that can become part, part of your of design, part of the charm. It's <laughs> your, it it's your person. Yeah, these are both. I'm right. Both I'm both so. twisting to the right. Mm -hmm. That'd be cool. It's and then the see, direction. you can let it go and see if you got a good high twist on it. You want to twist in the same direction. Yes, exactly. And this is one way of making tassels as well. Our tasseled fringe on a weaving, you twist them in the same direction and they curl. Tassels? Pardon? Are tassels are trimmed, did you say? Um, tassels. Now, these are, okay, these are different sizes or lengths. Mm -hmm. I'm going to knot the ends together just like I did in my overhand at the beginning, just to secure these. Um, if I didn't do it, that would be okay. They tend to uncurl at the end. Now, I'm just going to let go. And then it'll twist back in the opposite direction. Cool. More magic. <laughs> <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs>